Well, the last stop in the WSLS tank, Kodiak Shredding Shredathon, ends up being the best. That's as far as the amount of documents shredded is yeah, concerned. A, yeah, there's a lot of people out there today. As WSLS 10's Don Jeffries finds, today's stop in the Star City brought in more than 185,000 pounds. Kodiak Shredding started getting ready for Roanoke last week. We bring more trucks here, more employees than any of them. And Roanoke doesn't disappoint, with 185,000 pounds unloaded for shredding. It's 10 years worth of files that I have kept in my basement and referred back to, but I am cleaning house. I'm yeah. done with them. Tammy Shepard and dozens of people just like her lined up early to get business papers and personal papers destroyed. Stuff for my deceased mom and dad, my wife and two brothers and myself. Stuff you're scared to throw away with identity theft. Jason Handy says they, like so many others, have hung on to them for too long. For the last two years, I've said we need to do that. Never have. So paying the price for it today. But the price of the free shredathon is unbeatable. Small business residential, it, it saves a lot of money. Uh, some people, is, you know, not financially able to do it. It, this, it just helps them out. Roanoke marks the last stop this year, but people are already planning in anticipation of the next one. Have a good one. And I'll be back next time you have one, too, to do personal items. In Roanoke, Don Jeffries, WSLS 10.